Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're here checking out the Sims 4 Urban Homage Kit. In fact, we actually received two brand new kits for the Sims 4 today. The other kit is called Party Essentials and it's a build kit if you can already tell by its title. I'll be covering that kit as well in a separate video. In case you didn't know, the Sims 4 Urban Homage Kit is actually a collaboration between the Sims and Abonix. Abonix is an amazing simmer who has literally moved mountains for the game and I'll link all of their socials down below. I just want to say congratulations girl i am so freaking excited to check this out it looks amazing i can't wait to see what you've done with this kit i also just want to toss in the fact that i have purchased both kits with my own money the ea creator network is a little slow when rolling out the codes for kits and so i wanted to get these videos up for y'all asap so i decided just to purchase them myself so without any further ado let's dive in to the kit description styles for the city these modern looks are inspired by a time and place near and dear to a bond they're bold, unapologetic, and reflect a style Ebonix wanted to share with the Simmer community. Forward-facing throwbacks. Embrace a medley of standout colors and lively patterns. Iconic graffiti shirts, a bright bodysuit, and glamorous nails are just some of the options your Sim has for self-expression. I absolutely couldn't resist creating some outfits for y'all so that you could get a better feel of this kit before I showed you each item individually. This is going to be one of my most used favorite favorite kits. I love all of the assets within it and I cannot wait to show them off to you. But we're going to start off with the females. Here's like a little a little preview and I'll show you all the other outfits at the end that I made. But I just I just wanted to give you all like a little a little sneak peek. How gorgeous. Like seriously, are we kidding? Look at London. She's beautiful from her headscarf to her accessories, her fingernails. Nothing about this outfit disappoints. As you saw earlier, we do get a brand new headscarf with this kit and it is chock full of different swatches and beautiful African patterns. I love that there is virtually a color for every single outfit in your Sims wardrobe and the best part it's compatible with these beautiful brand new bamboo hoops that we got but they're not just bamboo hoops they actually have three different earrings in this little cluster so we have the bamboo hoops we have these like cubic zirconia crystal hearts and then these little like ball studs now you know me I'm gonna give some some modders some suggestions I think having these earrings as individual assets would be amazing I love this set though this is such a beautiful beautiful set and the swatches too are really cool because they kind of like change on the earrings and whatnot and I don't know I just really love these a lot i think these are probably one of my favorite um earring stacks that we've ever gotten in the game i just i really like these ones a lot so speaking of piercings and things we also got this triple piercing so a double nose piercing with a septum i love this i love the concept and everything about it there's only just one little thing that kind of i don't know it just kind of like i wouldn't say turns me off per se the concept's beautiful but something about this mesh looks off i don't know what it is but i just love the concept so much that I wish it didn't look kind of like weird to me. Does anybody else see it or is it or is it just me? I can't quite put my finger on it, but something about this mesh looks off. Our last and final accessory is this triple necklace stack. I love this so much. Oh my gosh, I've actually been wanting something like this in game for a very long time. I feel like the accessories as a whole in this pack are super duper solid and I noticed every one is in a group of three. It's like there's three necklaces, three earrings, three nose rings. I don't know if that was intentional, but it's just something that I noticed. If any CC creators are out there watching, I'm gonna need these individualized stat because these necklaces are to die for. Okay, so let's start going through all of the clothes. This first piece here, threw me for a loop because it looks like it's just a regular schmegular shirt, but it's not. It is a full bodysuit. <laughs> Oh my god, I don't think the Sims team has ever done anything like this before. I could use this as a swimsuit if I wanted to. I could use this as a workout outfit. And yeah, I could actually use it as a top because it will tuck into just about everything that you can think of. I think this is a really cool concept and they should do this in the future. At first, I thought this was like a little error. Maybe it was like miscategorized. It was supposed to be in the full body, but no it actually 
actually is a multi-functioning item. Yeah, <laughs> and it's so beautiful. I love this. I really, really like this. Um, anyway, we got a nice oversized tee here with some graffiti on it. I am loving the graffiti items. I think these are so cool. It's also like kind of reminding me of like the 90s or when you would go to like the state fair and you would um, like get like, you know, shirts that they would spray right in front of you. I think I had a Playboy one at like what 18 I really don't know what I was thinking but it just reminded me of that so that's cool and I also love like how long they are too great night night shirt we have this beautiful jersey oh my gosh the things that I would pair this with I love all of the different like logos and like um graphics and just you know the colorways and stuff I think I think this palette is beautiful I love how colorful this kit is actually this top here is really cute I kind of want to put some pants on her though because it's just not it's not giving you all the full effect but this little cropped jean jacket with this little tube top crop top whatever you want to call it is also such a vibe look at that the pockets even the buttons oh my gosh there's so much detail that went into this kit I love it I love it I love it um let's move on to the, the tank top the graffiti tank top that I was talking about earlier literally it was like this it was this color, but it said Playboy on it, and I thought it was the coolest, the coolest kid ever. Like I really did. <laughs> I love that there's some solid swatches though in this tank, and it kind of looks like it's been like rolled up a little bit. That's a cool concept. The red. Oh my gosh, especially against her skin tone is beautiful. Really loving the color story on this. So much fun. All right, so we got some more like, you know, juicier tops coming through here. This one's really nice. It kind of has like a vest vibe with this. Well, not really like a vest. It kind of reminds me of like a vest. Like you would button it in the front for some reason. But I love like the two-tone accents on it. And then y'all see like the mesh um, shirt underneath. Love that. Let's check out some of these swatches though okay so like the mesh alternates colors we've got like some solids in here too this is really fun and yeah anything in this kit can be mixed and matched too by the way in case you were wondering I thought for some reason the mesh like tucked into the pants, but it totally didn't. So yeah, like you could even wear it with these these pants here and it looks good. Actually, everything looks good. I will say this shirt though, I feel like we have something very similar already in game, but I'm not even mad about it because like the patterns and the prints on this are just so beautiful. And this type of top is just, I think it's a classic. Um, I love what they did here. I feel like it's very revealing and like the sleeves, but like in a good way, you know, it's like tasteful, but a little a little showy i like that now this jacket and like the jacket shirt combo okay with the pants especially i would wear this in real life like i would wear this this is so freaking cool looking i love it like it almost looks like it's satin the jacket you know like just the details um on the bands and stuff everything is just it's just giving i love it so much like <laughs> this is such a cool jacket and this swatch too is like a beautiful rose gold I don't mean to talk fast, okay, y'all, but like I am obsessed with this kit. If you haven't already noticed, um, this is also really cool too. I love this. This is a dashiki. Um, it's an African garment and it is beautiful. So this is really cool to see some African uh, rep representation in the game. I know that a lot of people would like to see more of it. And I think this is a good step. Hopefully we get an African themed world. I think that would be really freaking awesome because we don't really have anything quite like that at all in the game and it would just be nice to see so hey look at that a little a little dashiki i think it's really beautiful now we have what reminds me of the 90s through and through and i do see a little 90s inspo in this kit and um that's also really popping right now too so it's kind of cool to see it being brought into the game but this little butterfly halter top is so beautiful i love this a lot it's really really unique looking I don't have anything like this in my game. I don't even think I have anything CC related like this in my game. And I also really love how it pairs with these pants here. So speaking of pants, let's hop into the bottoms. This is what we get. Um, we have this cute little skirt here. It's a jean skirt, has some pockets. It has like a nice thick chunky belt. Also kind of reminds me of something that you would have probably seen in the early 2000s. Maybe that's what I'm thinking. Early 2000s with the butterfly top. Yeah, somewhere in there. I don't know. <laughs> 
Th that era for me was a blur, but <laughs> this is cool. I like this swatch for this this uh, jean or denim, 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 <laughs> denim uh, skirt here. Really, really nice. Anyway, we have these pants that actually have like this like corset lace to them all the way up the thigh. These are super fancy. I'm not sure what's happening down here at the ankles. I don't know if that's like supposed to be like that. I mean, it doesn't necessarily bother me, but it is doing something a little weird. I don't know if y'all can see that, but this is really cool too. I don't know why, but the color story for this palette reminds me of like bubble gum, <laughs> like the bubble, like bubble, the little bubble gums that you'd put like in the machine. Do you know what I mean? Like it's just like very primary colors, but like they're super vibrant. These basketball shorts are also a huge hit for me. I love like the patches and like all the different logos on them. I'm also really excited because they're available for both the males and females right off the bat no like category mishap so that's super cool this one reminds me of oh my god what's the candy sweethearts is that it yeah love this love it okay so these pants yeah as you can already guess they're they're hands down my favorite they match with a lot of different things you can make that cute track suit with that jacket that i loved earlier um you can do just so much with with these pants i feel like these are a very nice versatile pair of pants our last pair of pants is actually a pair of jeans again with this nice beautiful studded belt we have some nice vibrant colors in there a lot of like texture on the actual pant itself and yeah that's pretty much a wrap for all of the clothing items we do have some accessories <laughs> oh my god y'all these these rings are ringing like they are so freaking loud literally look at how beautiful they are oh my god i can't even imagine like how much time that took i wonder if we can get these individualized too because this twist ring right here is just it's calling my name <laughs> and it's loud i love these also the fingernails that we got are really cool too they're super edgy i'm feeling like I, i'm I, I don't know i'm feeling like i'm getting rock star vibes from these i love like the sparkle and the glitter and the chrome tips this is cool this is super cool abonic should be proud because she literally <laughs> i hate to i hate to do the dad puns but she nailed it we're almost done but we're not done yet we do get a pair of shoes for the females and this is what they look like it is a pair of zippered ankle boots that have like this flame design to them i thought these were super duper cool i love how thick like the platform is it even looks like the bottom of the shoe is black interesting choice to have the zipper facing the outside but i love it i think they have a lot of personality and flair and pizzazz i like i said earlier i can't wait to play around with this kit more because i feel like there's so many things that you could do with it so speaking of so many things i want to show y'all some of the outfits that i made this one is reminding me of like a girl band you know what i mean like a girl band costume we got the bamboo earrings we got some fun eyeliner we've got that bu uh, butterfly little like halter top the nails the pants uh, i think these sneakers are from like the ichion arrivals that kid is a definite hit for me i love the sneakers in it i'm pretty sure let me just double check for y'all um yeah mm -hmm. this is the inchion inchion rivals kit yeah love that and then our third outfit here is a little more laid back so you can see kind of how i paired the basketball shorts with another pair of sneakers from the same kit that you saw the sneakers from before <laughs> and then we have the little um tank top that's a part of the urban homage kit our last outfit you already saw that but this is probably one of my favorites i just love how everything comes together you would think like the accessories and stuff especially like the rings are a lot but this is the one circumstance where i feel like more is just more it looks so good so so good okay let's move on to the males we're gonna jump straight into the accessories so the males do you get the same piercings as the females or like jewelry items now i don't know if i'm just seeing stuff again but for some reason the mesh on this nose ring uh combo looks better on the males like i don't know maybe i'm just maybe i'm just you know just seeing things just just being crazy i don't know but the earrings also are very Available for the males as well as the necklaces it would have been cool to have the males get their own gold chains or like you know kind of like the same idea and same concept here but maybe just 
chains, you know? I think that would be really neat, but I'm still really happy that they have access to the same accessories. So let's dive into their catalog. These are the tops. These are the bottoms. I'm actually just gonna put a pair of, or pair, or pair of pants on him right now to show you the top. So this top is really neat. I love the length on this. I love the vest. I love the denim. At first I was kind of worrying uh, that it would be a little like, I don't know, that would remind me of something from like cottage living or something, but oh my God, I was so wrong. Like, no, this is so different and it's gorgeous. Like, I just love this so much. It's very simple, but it's also unique, you know? We have the graphics tee looking really, really good on the guys as well. I love this. I can't wait to use these. And then we have our jersey. I didn't realize how long the sleeves were but I really like them. Like, I love them a lot. And then we have the dashiki. I'll show you guys what this looks like on the males. Very nice. We also have a top that's kind of similar to the first one, except it is a little bit longer, like it's a long sleeve. I love the crew neck and how thick it looks. Also, this vest is super cool. I feel like I could use this vest on a lot of different sims. Like this particular shirt, I feel like it could be um it could be catered to different types of aesthetics and types like this could work with cottage living it could work with just about any type of aesthetic that you have it, it's just i don't know i really like it and this last item here is probably my favorite i love this jacket so much it kind of surprised me a little bit because i was expecting it to be like denim for some reason and it's kind of like this satin material with these little zippers here too i love oh my gosh i love this this maroon color with the white shirt underneath especially with these pants it's so clean it is so clean i love that I, i'm like even though i've already looked at this i'm acting like this is the first time i've seen it because it just keeps impressing me okay cool let's check out the pants so we have our bottoms actually you know what you guys don't mind if i take a shirt off right okay we have our basketball shorts these are still one of my faves love these so many good pieces y'all so many good pieces uh we have these really really cool jeans and they kind of have like this patchwork vibe to them with the little like bandana um pieces also look at the beautiful patterns intertwined in that i love them i think the cut is pretty good too it's not too tight but it's also like not too big um, and there's a lot of fun, like different swatches in here. If you kind of filter through like this one, I think, wait, this one. Yeah, this one's it. This one's my favorite. I love this one. And then we have pants that actually look really good with the dashiki. Um, they're kind of like dress pants. I really don't know what type of pants these are supposed to be. Like they're kind of a cross between casual and also dressy too, which could be very nice if you had like a formal occasion that your Sims wanted to go to, but you didn't want to be overly formal, you know? Like this would look really good with like a collared shirt, I think. Yeah, I like that. So there is a full body outfit for the males and it is a pair of these overalls with a hoodie. I know, I know, it's beautiful. <laughs> I'm like, wow, I'm just over it. I'm over it. Like this right here, this is for me, I swear to goodness i i can't even believe this is like in our game this is why the sims needs to keep working with like us simmers because we know best i'm just saying we just know what we like and this is great i love this this is so cool all right anyway there is the accessories you guys saw those earlier all the same thing unfortunately no new shoes for the males oh what it would have given for like a pair of timberlands or something like that i feel like that would look so nice with this outfit here and just like every other outfit honestly but let me take you through my pre-made outfits that I did I tried to use these shoes I think these are from outdoor retreat and I thought this was the closest thing that I could get to a pair of Tim's and I love this entire outfit so yeah I think it's great and then the third outfit that I've got going on again with the Tim's but we have basically just the overalls and the uh, hoodie by itself nothing really too crazy it's not really overly stylized um and number four is a really fun like workout outfit if you're wondering where these shoes are from they're from oh gosh like throwback fit kit like one of our first kits love these basketball shoes i think they look very good with the shorts and then the jersey and then i have like this big old watch on not sure where the watch is from honestly i'd have to go and look for you uh it is from snowy escape i thought that looked really nice it's a little gaudy 
but I still like it. I think it looks good. And then our last outfit is, of course, the dashiki and then those pants that I was talking about. And I paired them with this, uh, or I paired this outfit with the shoes from for rent and I thought they tied in the outfit quite nicely. Well, that pretty much wraps it up for the brand new Sims 4 Urban Homage Kit. As you already know, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. If you're looking for some more pieces to brighten up your Sims wardrobe, maybe you wanna get something a little more trendy in their closet, I definitely think you should pick up this kit. This is such an amazing asset to the game and I am so proud of Abonix and the Sims team for bringing this to us because they did a beautiful 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 job anyway y'all i'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here i hope y'all enjoyed and if you did you know what to do boo don't forget to go ahead and uh, comment rate, and subscribe <laughs> let me know what y'all think in the comments down below where the sun does not shine and i will see you all next time bye guys